And the idea there was to introduce children to the terms that they may hear from their doctor, to teach them a little bit about STEM topics, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics, but also to introduce the idea of medicine in a way that was exciting and fun and hopefully inspiration with this STEM-based comic. And I just talked to the kids about what the names of the characters mean and how they translate to real world science and medicine to teach them. And so far, we've been, we've been really warmly received by multiple different organizations and schools. Most kids need something visual that's, that's stimulating visually, you know, in order to capture and to remember, to recall this information. Education, not to be critical of the education system, but, but education in America has really gotten away from the kinesthetic learning but I think that the, the first step in getting there is, is creating educational platforms that are interesting and exciting to kids. We have so much technology nowadays, there's no reason not to incorporate visual learning. You'll see that the powers and the names have, have a lot to do with medical terminology, whether it's a cell type or a specific uh, power that we have in our body. It's been translated into the superhero world. I, I really love doing this because for me, my life is about service. You know, as a, as a surgeon, like I said earlier, I can take care of as many people as I can see as a surgeon, but you're limited in your ability to reach multiple people, especially have a global reach. And as an adult surgeon, I don't have the ability to help kids as much. So this gives me the opportunity to reach out to kids. My goal with this is to really get kids excited about STEM topics, to be excited to be a scientist or a mathematician or an engineer. The storyline is really about biomechanical engineering, science, technology. It's all kind of melded into the storyline. And so my hope is that we will invigorate children to be interested in learning, maybe become a healthcare professional, but anything related to STEM topics is good.